Hey fam, welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, my name is Carolyn Ann and my channel is a lifestyle channel where you will follow us on our journey to becoming debt free as well as financially stable. In today's video, I will be sharing with you five perfumes that I picked up from Target and it's the Mix Bar brand. I did remove the packaging, but I have not opened them. So I wanted you to see what they look like in the box. The first one is Whipped Almond. And this is what the packaging looks like. And the packaging is really, really pretty. Um, I love the design. And the perfumes are $19.99. I did get them where they were, I wanna say 20% off with the Target app that you use. But let's see what this smells like. It's a hint of almonds. It's not too powerful, but it smells really, really good. It's a smooth smell, and I think this will pair with any of these to mix and match. And that's what you do. You either wear them alone or you can wear them with another scent that they have. But this one, again, is the whipped almond, and it smells delicious. The next one that I have is called Glass Rose. I'm sorry if the light is hitting it. I wanted to do this in the daytime, but I didn't get a chance to. So I'm hard, sorry if the lighting is hitting it with a glare. So let's see what this one smells like. And again, I did remove the plastic, but I did not take um, open the packaging. So this one it looks like this and again it's got the same type of packaging it's more of a pink tone and it's a real light fragrance mm. and it smells really good it's got a hint of rose and I'm not sure what that other scent is that's in it but this one smells really good and it will mix well with I want to say one of the other ones that I'm going to bring up but this one is the glass rose the next one that I'm going to bring up is wood elixir and this one I believe is a unisex it can be worn by a man or a woman but this is what this one looks like. And again, the packaging is really pretty. They did a really good job on the packaging. Let's see what this one smells like. And it doesn't smell like I thought it was. It's got a hint of a hint of wood, but it's not really strong. It smells sort of spicy to me but it smells really good and I think this would pair good with the glass rose that I was just showing you but this is the packaging for that one the next one that I'm going to show you is the sparkling hibiscus and I got a smell of this at the store and I really liked it so I don't remember what it smelled like because I've been having these for a while. So let me see what that smells like. Oh my God. This one smells really, really good. And this one is the Sparkling Hibiscus. Oh man. I don't know how to explain what a Hibiscus smells like, but guys, it smells really good. It smells sexy to me. And this is what this packaging looks like. Again, they got the same packaging. This this is probably going to be one of my favorites. The last one I got was the Vanilla Bourbon. And I am all for anything that is mixed with vanilla and bourbon. So, let's see what this smells like. And I'm hoping 
that it smells the way I think it's going to smell. But this is what the bottle looks like. And let's test it. That's it. This smells so good. It doesn't smell too much like vanilla or too much like bourbon. It is a good mix between the both. And I think the, this will be good worn alone or paired with something else. They have a couple of other fragrances that I want, but they were out of stock. But if I had to choose, I'm going to say my favorite would be the Sparkling Abyss, the Vanilla Bourbon, and I'm going to say the Wood Elixir. And I would have never thought that this would be one of my top picks. I do love the smell of the other two, but I would have to say though that would be the order that they would go in. Um, I think the Whipped Almond would go in next in the glass rose would be the last one however they all smell good but that would be the order that i'd like them in i am going to get the other two so that i can test them out i think it's like two or three of them but i'm going to get the others to see how they smell and see if it's something that i'm going to enjoy i did pick up three more fragrances so hold on let me get those so i did pick up three other fragrances that have nothing to do with target or the mix bar. I have two that are by Ellen Tracy and I love that her scents are soft and floral. This one is uh, luminous and it has a sweet floral smell to it and I don't know how to explain it but it smells really good and I love the packaging that she has it in. And the next one that she has is courageous and that's what this looks like and again this is a sweet floral it just this one has more rose smells to it and this one i am not sure what that is but both of them smell really good and that's what this looks like the packaging is really cute and the last one that I picked up, I picked up today, I have been picking this up and putting it down and picking it up and putting it down. And finally today I decided that I was going to purchase it. And that is So Cray Cray. Guys, I have picked this perfume up, I don't know how many times. It smells so good. And what's funny is, there is a meaning behind the name. My nickname is Cray. It's actually Crayola. I have shortened it to Cray because I've gotten too old for the Crayola. So I've shortened it to Cray. <laughs> so I thought this was really cute to pick up. But it does smell good. She has... There is another fragrance that is made by them. Um, and I'm not sure who actually makes this. But they do have another one that I want to pick up. And I can't remember the name of it. But I will probably be picking it up. And the last thing that I want to show you. I got these at Target for $5. And it's just a Lazy Susan that turns around. And that is what I am going to be putting my perfumes in. Just so that I can um, store them better than what I'm storing them in. Because right now, I have them in a basket. So this is what it looks like with the fragrances that I just showed you. So all of them are stored in here. And I am going to organize them. I have four of these. They were at Target in what used to be the dollar spot. I don't know what it's called now. But that's why I picked it up and they were $5 each. So I am going to um, split them up. I'm going to put my body sprays in one. My perfumes, I'm going to split my perfumes and put them up in the other ones. And then I have some face oils and different things like that that I'm going to put in the last one. So 
but I just wanted to come and show you what perfumes I picked up at Target. If you don't want to break the bank and you still want to smell good, go to Target and try their mixed bath. They're really good and they all smell good and you can mix and match them so you can make your own fragrances off of the fragrance that they already have so but that is all that i wanted to share with you i wanted to open them up on camera before i started wearing them i've been having them for about a week a week and a half and i kept saying i was gonna film it and unbox them so i can start using them so that is what i'm doing today if you enjoy this video please give me a thumbs up i would greatly appreciate it and it would help my channel and if you have stuck around this long please consider subscribing and joining the family we would love to have you but that is all for this video fam please like share and subscribe and don't forget to hit the notification button so that you'll be notified next time i upload a video thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next video bye guys